Alright, hello everyone, and welcome back to my Fallout 4 series of Depravity, where today we are still here at the Rexford Hotel because I forgot to check something at the end of the last episode before we ended, and that was our new drinking buddy bartender. I just wanted to have a look. I forgot entirely with everything else we were looking at quest-wise that, um, oh yeah, we... We made the selection to have him pop into existence here. So, yeah, he just appears to stand right there at the lobby bar all day, every day, and is our lovely new robotic bartender. And to be frank, I kind of wish we could have him in the casino one, too, instead of the other guy. Oh, well, drinking buddy, you at least have a job here. <laughs> You know, we could have done this easily later on when we came back to the Rexford uh, after getting our two new employees, but I figured, what the heck, I meant to do it at the end of the last episode, forgot, so beginning of this one. Now, as for the plan today, we are going to hire our final two people that we can seem to hire, uh, like we saw on the, um, the management st uh, computer last time. The other two seem to be just straight hires, kind of like Buddy here, where they're just going to pop into existence. So we'll, we'll test that when we get back from these two missions, as we have Isabel Cruz and Sito to uh, try and convince to come here. I'm intrigued by the Isabel one. I mean, we did convince her to stop being the mechanist, so... um. Cool, hopefully she needs an IT job. And I had to look it up because I could not remember who Sito was. He was the dude we fought Gator Claws with at Nuka World. I remembered him now once I, you know, went to the wiki. And so uh, we should be good on recruiting him too. There shouldn't be any vanilla things we have to do with either of these two to maybe convince them. Anything we do along with them, like with uh, the person we grabbed last time. Oh my god, I've already forgotten who that was. Uh, wait, hold on, hold on. We can scroll down here. Sierra. Sierra. Wonderful. So, yes, if they have anything that they need us to do to convince them, it should be something new to the mod. Uh, but we'll see. We'll see. So let's head on out into the world. We'll do Isabel Cruz first, then Sito. So let us head out into Good Neighbor so we can fast travel. Wait, we can fast travel into the Rexford Hotel. Can we fast travel out? Have I tested this? I don't know if I ever tested that. Oh, well, we're already in Good Neighbor. Okay, so where are we heading? Right over here. Am I insane? Didn't last episode, didn't it pop them on the Mechanist Lair? Which is why I immediately went, oh, the Mechanist. Uh, I mean, okay, it's sending us here now. F fair? Huh. Alright. <laughs> yeah, I could have sworn it had the waypoint on the Mechanist Lair last time. We weird? Maybe she moved? <laughs> Question mark? I don't know. Oh, well, let's just go chat with her. She was the mechanist, right? I only, you know, thought about it last episode because the icon was on the mechanist lair, so that made me think, oh, her. I really don't honestly remember her too much, though, because even though that wasn't a bad DLC, story-wise, it was kind of meh. So <laughs> Best part about that DLC was the ability to make our own robots, which was super fun. Uh, but, I mean, we'll find out soon enough who she is. I'm pretty sure she is that, though. Oh, yeah, which in that DLC, uh, did I say mod earlier? DLC, didn't we enter the Mechanist Lair through here? So maybe that's why it's sending me to here now? Which is weird, considering we know about the Mechanist Lair. Oh well, oh well, let's just go follow the waypoints and see where it's taking us and see if we actually are going to have to do anything to convince her. I don't know, just there was a lot more... I'm just worried. I'm worried because last episode we had so much more information when we were in the terminal about Sierra. You know, it had a whole thing. If you've done these missions, it'll help with this, blah, blah, blah. Uh, but we didn't get those with these two. So, with my luck, what's going to happen is we're literally just going to go there, talk to him, be like, hey, want a job? And they're going to go, cool. And that's going to be it. <laughs> we're not actually going to have any content with it. But, um, we'll see. Oh, God. Oh, no, she is down here. Okay. Oh, God. Now i got to remember how to get down. I assume this way. This looks right. Okay, cool. And down into her lair. 
God, yeah, we should just go into the Mechanist Lair. I'm pretty sure that's where this is leading us to. And yeah, here we are. <laughs> we should have just gone to the Mechanist Lair. Granted, it didn't take us long to get here, so that's not really a problem. But, um, okay. Yeah, why did it suddenly switch away from that? And did I go the wrong way? Oh, 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 God. I don't remember how to get around here. <laughs> we've, we've gotten farther away from her now. We've gotten farther away. I think I need to double back. <laughs> I am lost. I'm tempted to no-clip through the wall over here just to go down into the, the lair. Is there a something I may have missed around here? Like a stairwell? No, no, that is the way we're having to go. Okay, okay. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh. God, where's that? Is that going to go further down or... Uh, you know what? I'm just going to walk. I'm just going to walk. I'm just going to walk. I don't know where that elevator goes. <laughs> it probably goes down, but with my luck, it'd go up. And we'd be even further away from her. All right, all right. Just go through here. And... All the lovely robotic stuff. Yeah, we should have just we should have just selected the uh, the other place. Did I take a wrong turn again? Oh wait, no. <laughs> We're gonna get lost. We're gonna get lost. I haven't been here in so long. I don't remember any of this. Okay, this way. I'm just gonna jump down here. And now, oh god, now what? <laughs> Oh, looks like that. Yeah, we should have just gone to the Mechanist Lair. We should have just fast-traveled to the Lair. Thank you. you? Well, that didn't help. <laughs> oh, wait. Nope, never mind. This opened. All right. Good, good, good. Huh? And what happens? God, I really don't remember any of this. <laughs> We're just, we're just trapped in here now. We're just trapped in here. Uh, you know what? I think we're going to no-clip. I think we're going to no-clip. What the hell's the point of this room? Boy, I really don't remember anything from the Mechanist Lair. Huh. Yeah, I'm just going to no-clip. <laughs> I don't know where we're going. We should just go to the other thing. There we go. Through the world. Yay. There she is. Okay. <laughs> Yep, Mechanist Lair should have just gone to the other waypoint. Hi, Isabel. How are you? Hey there. <laughs> you got. You need a job instead hey, of just sitting just here all the time. Thing, if you have a minute. Uh huh. Well, that's on your mind. What's on your mind? In case I haven't said it enough, I really am sorry about this. Yeah, it's okay. I got cool it's robots just, out of it. I really did think I could make a difference. Would you like an IT job? <laughs> You're gonna have to live with that. And yeah, some people died. Yeah, it's the yeah, it's the Commonwealth. A lot of people have constantly accident. Yeah, you're just gonna have to live with it. You're gonna have to live with that. I know. I only ever wanted to make the Commonwealth a safer place. <laughs> I can't take back what I've done. No. I only hope that somehow I can make up for this. Okay. Well. Hmm. Well, I'm curious what she thinks. Have any suggestions? I can turn this around. I, I just need a chance. Well, that wasn't a suggestion. You know, I've got a great place you could set up permanently. Mm hmm What do you think about coming to work for me at the Hotel Rexford? Are you ready to start tracking down some robots? Uh, Actually, no? I was hoping you could dance. Wait, no, we, she was IT. Why did I have a feeling you'd say that? No, uh, why, why did we say that? It's an I'm IT job. I'm not good with people. The mechanist gave me a way to put myself out there without really being out there at all. Uh-huh. Look, sometimes things don't go the way you planned. That's life. Too true, sadly. But don't pass it up. This is an opportunity you will never have again. <sighs> you are right. I need to move on. Isabel, I'm proud of you. You made the right choice. Right. Right. <laughs> well, that's good to know. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Consider it done. Okay. Glad to have you, you on board. I won't regret this. I promise. None of the Commonwealth will. 
I mean, I know... Okay, yep, that was it. We just had to talk to them. Uh, no, oh, hello. She's head to the New Rexford Hotel. She is also available as a companion. Ah, oh, nifty. Talk to her at any time to recruit her. Spells protected, not essential. Oh, God, not one of those again. Okay, but I mean, she's just going to live in the hotel. I mean, I know that the terminal on the job posting said, you know, they may have to dance, but I don't like that we sold it to her as dancing. She's, it's, she's, IT. IT. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, well. We got her now working, so welcome to the jungle. Also, what did I see? Uh, oh, yeah, I forgot I only have one person there. Never did anything with that in the save file. Hmm. Well, let's go to Nuke World and go get Sito, who is just going to be another conversation. It's just going to be another conversation. <laughs> yeah, I was hoping we'd get another little quest like with Sierra, but, um, oh, well. We'll do this and then head back to the Hotel Rexford and hire those other two people straight from the terminal just to see... And then we'll check in with them at the place, see what they're like in the hotel. And then that'll probably be it for things we do with the hotel until I occasionally come back off camera to grab money. <laughs> and we'll head back. We'll head back to Fallon's for the next episode to, uh, you know, we'll probably work with Stella next time. I'm intrigued to see what that kid's got going. All right, where am I going? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh God. All the way up here. Okay. Cappy's Treehouse. There we go. I forgot that's where he lived. <laughs> you know, shouldn't be surprised that was where the whole gator claw thing was. Up in their little safari land? Was that what it was called? I don't remember. Like, it's been so long. So long. But yeah, it looks like this one's probably just going to be another conversation too. Since we didn't get all that extra info like we did with Sierra. Which is a little disappointing. I was really hoping we'd have a little, at least a little mini quest to convince them both. Like with Sierra, I was very pleased when we had the Sierra one. I mean, with the exception of having to go to the Nuka-Cola bottling plant, which is so loud. Oh, and now it's dark. All right, now how do, Oh, God, how do I get over there? Oh, wait, no, we need to go back this way. Ha, 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 ha. Hello, you. Forgot about the animals palling around here. Oh, there he is. There's our friend. Hey, buddy, I'm going to need you to put on some normal clothes uh, and work at my hotel. Hi, hi, Sito. How are you? Long time no see. Excuse me. Here. New friend, take. Mm-hmm. Oh, Nuka Power added. <laughs> Wonderful. So, advance the conversation here. You know what, though, first? That's very kind. Thank you. That's very kind. Thank you. You big help, Sito. Sito, thank you. No problem, buddy. So, any news? Any news around town? Zoo Sito home since small. Mm -hmm. Home too dangerous now. Mm -hmm. Sito not know where to go. Hey, I got a job for you. Working for me. Not sure I understand what you're talking about. Sad story. Oh, we want to cancel the quest. The road can be a lonely place until you meet someone to share it with. Well, I don't want to go that far. Yeah, work for me. Would you be interested in working for me? I have a place you could set up shop. Sito come with new friend. Sito help. Excellent, Thanks, that was easy. Big guy. That means a lot. Let's get out of here. That was super easy. Wow. Even quicker. Even quicker <laughs> than getting the mechanist. Alright, alright. He is now your companion. Talk to him with any time to discuss. Oh, also. Isabel's following me right now, isn't she? This That didn't click in my head last time. In here? Huh. <laughs> I got an entourage now, don't I? I actually don't see her. Well, did we lose her somewhere? I don't know. Oh, well. Uh, <laughs> that didn't click in my head. I probably should have taken her straight to the Hotel Rexford. Uh, okay, okay. We'll do the Commonwealth. All right. <laughs> Are they both following me now? Did I completely miss that when and not have that not click in my head? Can we have all of them following me? It'd be kind of fun. Hmm. Yeah, I forgot about that, that we had to take Sierra back there. Oh no, I only see Sito. <laughs> huh. 
Well, we'll find out if I really screwed up and we no longer have Isabel with us. I didn't even think about that. Did, did it say she was a follower or did she say she was going to go there herself? I don't know. To the Hotel Rexford. Let's roll. <laughs> I forgot about Sierra last time that we had, took her back with us to the hotel and went back into the kitchen for where she was going to work. Oh, did I just mess everything up. Hmm. No, it said completed on the mission, though, and we don't have the mission still, which we did with Sierra. We did still have the mission. Huh. I don't know. Well, we'll find out. We'll find out. Because, <laughs> yeah, we, we just looked at our quest, and it was back to the Reina thing at Fallon's. So, you good now? Are you following me now? Oh, my God, I think he still is. Uh... Should you just be working here now? Uh oh. Hey, Sito. Oh, how Sito thank new friend? Whoa. Wait, wait, wait here, oh, boy. In conversation for now. That was all. No worry. Let's go look around to see if we can find Isabel. <laughs> I am worried. It's I just nice screwed everything up. On the future for once. Yeah, because last time when we had Sierra with us, it had like it continued the quest, and we had a specific, specific marker that we had to go and walk back to before it ended, and we were good. But uh, hey, now oh god, <laughs> Hilarious, you're my way. Now they're just all here. Gabriel, same old, same here. Old. Anyone in my room? No, thankfully. Yeah, did I just maybe break things? <laughs> it's a possibility. Good to see you again. <laughs> Let's look around for Isabel. Hey, Ivan, I got a friend for you to train. So no, nice there's to Tori, Julie, to Amber. What a weirdo. All right, there's Sierra working back here. Oh God, how many how many Nuka Colas has she made? We already had so many. I don't know. <laughs> and yeah, he's just, uh, Sito's just following me now. He's just following me. Did I break things? I may have broken things. Yeah, no, I don't see an Isabella here either. Whoa, it's you. Fred, quiet. Got an Isabella in one of the rooms, maybe? Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Oh, wait, never mind. Oh, thank God you're here. Why is why is he still following me then? And I was wanting to look for you also, not only to make sure she got here, but also to see if she changed into like a more hotel outfit, like the others have. Uh, which now makes me wonder: is is Sito always going to look like he does out there? Hi, Cruz. Hi. I just wanted to say, I'm really happy, thankful that you've let me stick around here. No problem, friend. All right, well, uh, we're done then. We can just Never travel mind, with her actually. if we want. Right. <laughs> Good. I'm glad. Well, let's just drop off Sito then. It seems fine. Yo, Sito! Hey, How Sito thank new friend? Well, we're going to have to talk. I'm not waiting um, there. Hey, got a sec? No worry. Sito can help. Well, I'd like for you to... um. Yeah, just work here, so bye bye I think I need to run my mission solo for a while. And by Thank solo, you, I mean with two friend. others. Sito always remember you. All right, yep, and he's back at the Hotel Rexford. So was he always going to wear like uh, wear that clothing? Or, um, is he going to need to put on some new fresh threads like everyone else? Like uh, Dougal there put on a suit. So did Ivan. He put on a suit. You. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Well, let's go hire the other people, see what happens. <laughs> hire staff. Why would we ever disable Buddy? All right, let's get head and he uh, Edward, uh, Edward Deegan here. Job application from him? Oh, oh, so there are people that have... Okay. 
Okay, I was wondering why they were in here. I just figured it was a spawn them in, which it still probably is going to be. But they must have seen, lore-wise, seen the flyers and put in a job application. Well, let's see what his application is. See a security guard job application from a ghoul named Edward Deegan. When I asked him for references, he said his previous employer was no longer available. So I didn't hire him, even though we really need security around here. Should we hire him? Let me know, Ellie. Okay, I'm going to go back and what does Henry want? Can I only hire one? Is, he, is Henry also wanting security? See his job application. See a bartender job application from Henry Cook. As much as we need bartenders, something seemed off about him, so I didn't say yes. We had a few questions. Uh, he had a few questions about Morowski and expressed relief once I informed him of Morowski's passing. Should we hire Henry? Wait, where is he going to work? We already have Buddy and Dougal as bartenders. Oh, maybe down, maybe down in the spa area, perhaps? Alright, before we hire either of these fools... Because, yeah, we also got Sito and Ivan for security. Let's quick save. <laughs> let's see what happens. All right, let's get... Uh, let's just hire one of them and see. Let's hire the Henry Cook. Yeah, hire him as a bartender. See what happens. Henry Cook has been hired. He will tend bar in the downstairs area of the casino. Oh, the downstairs area. Oh, I didn't even notice that there was that downstairs bar. I always pass by it for the to go straight to the we kitchen. Kind of enjoying the alone time here. Well, let me just go back over here real quick. Good to know this. Still people. Oh yeah, there. right there. Taking a taking a break there, Sierra. Hi, Henry. Excuse me. I hope you're drinking because if you're not, well, I really can't help you. Uh huh. Uh huh. Well, your thoughts? Tell me what's on your mind. Uh, nothing much. No. Well, let's see how good of a bartender you are. Let's uh, see your shop. Here's what we got. I mean, it's the usual. Nothing special. A lot of whiskey, though. Damn. <laughs> All right. Well, bye bye. Nothing else I needed. Some other time. Okay, just kind of hoping maybe there might be a, something a little bit more fancy with him, but down we go to hire the other person. See what happens with him. I'm all right with Henry working that bar. And hire staff. Hire Edward. Yes. He will patrol the building and keep it safe. Oh, so he's just going to be around somewhere. Okay, so kind of like Ivan, but Ivan does seem to stick to the, like, second and third floor. Well, no. No, we actually, I've seen him in the lobby a lot, too. Hmm. Let's go find him. And see what he looks like. Oh, damn you, door. Ed Edward? How's it going? You're Rufus. No, no Edward here. That's Hilarios. Watch the other stairwell. No one. Need to relax. Hi, Gabriel. Stepping out to see the world, huh? Ah, here he is. Yo, Edward. Hi. Shoot. Your thoughts? Say what's on your mind. It's best to keep an open mind. I mean, fair. All right. And then he's got the fancy, uh, fancy threads. Well, I mean. What have you got for sale? Nothing out of the ordinary. I mean, I'm surprised you even are a store, but okay, that makes sense. Ammo and guns. Huh. Well. Okay, bye-bye. I'm good for now. Thanks. See you around. Thank you for being security. I appreciate it. Where's Sito? I need to see if he's changed clothes after two people getting hey, updated around here. By. He probably hasn't, has he? We might need to sleep for a little while for maybe to take. Not my favorite thing. I'm maybe. Sure. Actually, I don't see him anywhere in here. Isabel just seems to be chilling in this room. Okay. Weird. Oh, yeah, where the hell did he go? Oh, maybe he's in here. I didn't even think about looking in here. Light on to make it easier to see. No. Nope. Down we go. Is he in the back kitchen? Where the hell did Cedo go? <laughs> oh, there he is. He hasn't changed. He hasn't changed at all. Oh, that actually kind of disappoints me. I was hoping to see him in a suit. I thought that would be funny. You know what? I am going to sleep real quick just to check, and then we'll end the episode after being, I assume, disappointed. 
<laughs> I'll sleep for like 12 hours, or 24 hours. There we go, till 3 in the morning. Yeah. Give him time to change his threads. And then, yeah, we'll be done with the Hotel Rexford for a bit and get back to the, uh, to Fallon's to check in with those guys. We've got two quests there for sure right now, the one with Reyna and the one with Stella. So, yeah, we'll go check in with them. See what's what. But first, almost, almost, almost. Got it. We are very well rested. All right. Cedo, buddy? Nope. <laughs> Didn't have to go far. <laughs> Didn't have to go far at all. You know, he could change his clothing, I bet. We need to buy him a suit. Well, actually, do we... We might have one in one of these. Oh, heck yeah, form. Uh, we got a tuxedo, clean black suit. Yeah, we'll give we'll give him. The other security guys are wearing tuxes. We'll give him a tux. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cedo, come back. <clears throat> Here, my friend. New friend, day. Oh, you're giving me another gift. Thank you. Oh, Gator Claw meat. Where the hell did you get that? We're I trading now. I just want to trade. Cedo, show you thing. No, mm, oh, oh boy, I don't know if I want to see Cedo's thing. <laughs> See, his wild man rags, though, are pro he's probably not going to be happy about me switching up his stuff for something that's uh, not as good. Oh, I forgot we grabbed these recently. <laughs> uh, tuxedo! And equip. There we go. Now he looks the, uh, the part for uh, Hotel Rexford security. That was all. No, friend, not worry. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Keep the place safe, Sito. Keep the place safe. Heck yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, with that, that's going to be it for today, then. Uh, I'm pleased with how everything has gone here at the hotel. Uh, still a few things, though, that I kind of wish would change and be different. Don't know when we get the new caps, but we at least make some good money from this place. And also being the mayor of Diamond City, which is pretty sweet, too. But yeah, next time we'll head back to Fallon's and uh, work more with Stella, Reina, and all of them and see what's what over there. But hopefully you have enjoyed this kind of odd episode today. And you do come back for the next, but until that time, thank you for watching as always. We'll have a good one.